You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better Video. So tonight's video is one that I've been wanting to do for a while and I've not done basically because I always go shopping at Chaffer Centre and they never used to have a Primark there and it's basically the only place that I really go shopping. Um, so I never just ended up going to Primark and then I'd see people on like YouTube and Instagram in these really cute little outfits and I could not believe it was Primark. I think the, the last time I did a proper shop at Primark and actually went in, had a good like rummage around, God, years ago, like, I don't know, four years ago, something like that. And I've always been a little bit of a, I guess a Primark snob, and I'd kind of think, oh, there's nothing I'd really like, I'm not really going to go in, I just, it used to stress me out all the time. Um, but when I saw there was a new store open at the Traffic Centre, I thought I'm going to give it a go, and actually... It was all right. Like the two times I've been in, it's never been like crazy busy. The queues haven't been super long. It's not been that thing of like a jumble sale and when like everyone's all over the place. I don't know if I'm just going on quiet times or anything like that, but it's actually been quite an enjoyable experience. So I thought, I was there shopping it yesterday um, and I thought I'm gonna go and nip over to the new Primark, have a little rummage around. And I was very, very pleasantly surprised. I feel like there's some things in these bags you would never imagine they are from Primark. So I'm quite pleased with myself. Uh, I'm quite proud that I think I found like some little gems in there, which is not normally the case. It's usually other people I see um, finding the gems. Sorry, I feel like I'm literally all over the place in my hands. I had my nails done today for the first time since like, February, March or something and I feel very very sassy with my new nails um, but yeah if you are new here welcome to my channel my name is Beth obviously <laughs> I am um, I'm a mom I've got three children a stepson two little French Bulldogs and yeah my channel is basically fashion hauls some vlogs in there and just a lot of day-to-day -day stuff like fashion beauty a bit of lifestyle homework stuff like that so if you are new here and you're not subscribed and you do enjoy this video, it would be lovely to have you as a subscriber, so don't forget to hit that button. Yeah, let's just get into this haul. I'm just going to pull everything out of the bags. If there's any clothes or things like that, I'll try them on for you as well. i just let you know what I thought and the pieces that I got. So let's get into having a little look in these bags at all the goodies that I picked up. Okay, so I have two big bags to go through. So let's just start having a rummage. Okay, so I'm going to show you these. These were the first, one of the first things that I picked up when I went in. There was a whole section, I don't know if it's new because I just never go in there, but there was a whole section and it was like Primark Wellness and it was lots of like natural sustainability kind of products and little piece, bits and pieces like bamboo kind of makeup brushes all that kind of vibes but they also had some really gorgeous like nightwear loungewear and things like that so i saw these and i was so in love with these um they're like a really gorgeous kind of thin summer pajama set and they're so cheap they were 14 pounds i literally nearly bought these in an extra large because i thought it was the only size left but luckily i found a medium so basically, I just think they're so nice. The quality on them feels really lovely. They are like a really gorgeous, lightweight, airy, cute little pyjama set. And I thought, do you know what? These are so nice for while the weather's still warm. Even into autumn and winter, my heating is always so high up. Um, so I would be finding them too. I loved them. They're like a really nice wide leg pyjama. And they're like a really nice, traditional long sleeved top so I'll try them on but I just couldn't believe they were from Primark they actually feel so so nice they're made from organic cotton and the quality on them is just insane they also had like a night dress same as this so if I like these I might actually go back and get like the little night shirt because that would be really cute um with just some like big comfy slipper socks so I'm actually, I really want to put these on tonight, but I've actually fake tanned this morning. So I might wash it off before bed and then snuggle up in these tonight because how gorgeous are they? So cosy. Sorry, I did get a size large in these actually. I thought I got a medium, but these are actually a large. So they're very big. 
but I love a pyjama big and I just double checked that this was obviously adjustable so you can cinch those right in at the waist and they'll be super super comfy so yeah that was the first thing I got which I was so impressed with you would not believe that they are from Primark so super happy with those they're very like white company vibes even, that kind of thing. The quality on them is so good. And then next up, I got another one from the same little kind of section, the wellness section. And I got a new dressing gown. I don't need a new dressing gown. I've got about three white dressing gowns, like toweling ones. I thought this was really cute. It's like a little um, waffle kind of material dressing gown and it's got little cute short sleeves so I thought it was quite nice for now when it's quite warm and I just thought it was really cute again this is made from sustainable cotton it feels really nice the waffle on it makes it look loads more expensive and it's just so so sweet I thought it was so nice I got a size extra large in this because you can't have a dressing gown too big I just know that I will just I just knew it would look better really big and then just tied up at the waist, super super comfy. I don't actually know how much this was and I don't actually know where I put my receipt but I will have a little check and pop it on here but it was super cheap so yeah that one is cute or maybe it's on here no it's not on the um it's not on the hanger either nope so yeah that was cute love that one and then staying on the kind of pyjama vibe I also got these because you cannot go wrong with a pair of cozy slipper socks and it has been very rainy here for the last I'd say three or four days um, so I'm getting very much into my autumn vibes. So these pyjamas are going to be super nice and cosy for like the little autumn days where I can come home in the evening, put my pyjamas on, put my cosy socks on, light my candles and I just couldn't resist these. They're £1.80 and they're super soft and there's two pairs in there. Uh, so they had them in like grey and black and pink I think but I thought white are always cute so I got those and then also I picked up for my cozy evenings in some more candles I'm going to put these on my get the other one I'm going to put these on my two big um, candlesticks that I have on my mantelpiece and they are clean cotton and they smell lovely so these were two pounds each and they actually smell so so good so I got those as well and then I also got for a little evening pamper you know I love cleansing oils so I had to try this one out it is the Primark prep and perfect oil to milk cleanser so gently cleanse moisturizing and removes waterproof makeup so I'm gonna try that one out it was three pounds um, so I had to try that because I just love an oil cleanser so we will test that out and see what it's like I will let you know in the next vlog what I think of this so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss that yum okay and then I just got a few little bits so I actually picked up these shoes I thought they were so cute I've been after a little pair of like shoes like this so they're just like a little slip on and a bottom um, and just a low like chunky sole but then when I got them home I realized they were actually wide fit so I've not tried them let me just try them mm, I mean I've got kind of a wide foot anyway so I'll get away with that but if you've got a narrow fit I don't know whether they do them in their normal size but I thought they were really really cute and they had quite a few in this style and I just think they're a really nice shoe to wear like now with little shorts and dresses and then also they look amazing with jeans and I just love the like beige like natural woven little design on them and then they've got the little accent underneath the heel of like a gold and they were £10 I think yeah £10 I just wish I'd noticed they were wide fit but I think they'll be fine because my feet are quite wide but yeah I got those I couldn't believe they were £10 I really couldn't. 
but they were really sweet. And I also got a water bottle. They had loads actually, and they did have the really big, you know, huge ones, which I wish I'd got. I'm gonna get it next time I go because I'm trying to drink loads of water in the day and I thought that would be perfect because I can just fill it up and then I know that's what I need to drink all day. But I picked up this one. I'm not actually sure how much it was. It hasn't got a price on it. It didn't, oh, it has, it's £2.50. So I thought that was cute for like getting back to the gym or when I'm going for a little dog walk. Um, I'm gonna pop that and take that with me. So, got that little bottle. And then I also picked up one of these, which is like a toiletry set, which I've got some anyway, but my skincare, I feel like my skincare is all over the place at the minute. So I wanted to get one of these, which has like the three different bags in, so that I can put in like in the bathroom and have like, my night time, my morning, and then maybe like some little hair stuff or something. So I can just separate it out so that I know I can just grab which one I need out rather than sifting through all the different products. So I think I'm gonna pop those in my, box, underneath my sink I've got a shelf. So I think I'm gonna fill them with like morning, daytime, and then maybe like hair care or something. And then I know I just need to grab out the bag and go for it. Um, and I think they were five pounds, yeah. They were five pounds, but I thought these little like florally designs were quite cute. So I got one of those. And I also picked up these little earrings because I'm just loving a little earring at the moment. I never used to wear earrings, but I'm absolutely loving little earrings. So I got these, they're like a little pearly drop little design and they were just two pounds. I thought they were really sweet. And in, oh. My friend Hattie is gonna laugh her head off at me if she sees this, but um, she has one of these little handbag tidies and I always laughed at her about it, but I thought I was gonna pick one up because I think it would actually be very, very handy just to have this and then just switch it over between my bags because I hate, I have just got into that point where I just never know where anything is. I'm just losing like lipsticks and lip bars. I lost my AirPods for like three weeks. I only found them this morning. Whereas if I have this, it can all go in here and I know where everything is and then I can just pop it because I think that will fit in my little Gucci which is one of the bags I use all the time and I think it will also fit in my Sea by Chloe bags. They're like my normal just like daytime casual bags. So I thought that was cute and it was three pounds so I'm getting very old and sensible but I actually quite like it. Um, so I got that, I thought that was cute. And then I picked up some clothing so I've not worn any Primark clothing for years and I was pleasantly surprised by their things. I bought a dress the other week when I just popped in with Effie because she wanted to get some bits and I really liked it but it just didn't suit me and then after, but I thought the dress itself was actually really nice so I thought after that I'm going to try it, I'm going to go for some of their bits and bobs. So I had a good look around their clothing section and they did have some gems in there. I mean a lot of it is like not the best quality and very bright and slogany, which just isn't my vibe at all, but I did manage to find some pieces that were very me. So the first thing I got is this gorgeous little knitted tank. And I thought this would look really cute under blazers. I'm really liking a blazer and denim shorts at the moment. I'm gonna make the most of like the end of August and a little bit warmer weather before we go into autumn. And I thought this would be really cute to wear under little blazers. So it's a little knitted top. I think I sized up a few times. Yeah, I got a medium and it was just eight pounds. So I thought that was really, really cute just for layering under things. So that was the first thing I got. And then, oh, I just picked up this. Oh, these hangers drive me mad. Um, because I just thought it's a really handy thing just to have in your wardrobe. I've got like a white slip dress to go under things, but I thought this little nude one would be really cute just to go under little dresses if they're a little bit see-through. Um, and I just thought it's something that is missing out of my wardrobe. So it's 350. I got a size small and just one of those things that I'm just gonna wear under little sheer dresses or short things or whatever, but such a little essential that I was just completely missing. And they had these in loads of different colors. They had white, black, and then like the nude. So if you're looking for something like that, I mean, personally, I wouldn't wear that on its own. I would just wear that under things, but, and that was 350. And then I spotted this and I was like, oh my God, I love this top. 
it is so me I love a top like this it's just imagine this but like tucked in to some little shorts it's just really really lovely the only sizes they had left were a 16 and a 20 but actually I think it's supposed to be like more fitted but this is a size 16 and I was like I would wear it like super oversized anyway so I went for the 16 and then it's going to be really big and baggy and I think when that's on like you are never going to believe that it's from Primark so I'll style it up for you and we'll have a little look at it on but I just thought it was really really pretty and you could wear it with just some skinny jeans and have it loose and flowy or you could wear it with something high waisted with a big belt and tuck it in but yeah absolute bargain so that was £15 and yeah this is actually a size 16 and they have none left so it must have been super popular so if you can find it in a store you will be lucky but how cute is that and then another little gem that I found was this little silky dress I'm really trying to find some midi and maxi dresses that suit me and I thought this would actually be really really nice it needs an iron now I think this is the kind of dress that you could definitely like dress up or down down you could definitely wear it on a little date night some gorgeous little sandals you could wear it with some little heels or just some flaps and then you could definitely dress it down as well so you could layer it over just like a little boxy white t-shirt pair of like Doc Martin boots leather jacket I just think it's really really cute so I'm hoping in my head it's going to look how I think it's going to look how I'm visualizing it in my head but we will see I did size up I got a size 12 because I just wanted it to be loose baggy flowy I'm just really hoping that this is going to look nice I've been really trying to find midi dresses and maxi dresses that suit my shape but because I'm quite petite I'm only five, I'm only five foot four because I've got quite broad shoulders um, it, it, anything like sleeves which is everywhere at the minute and it just looks amazing on everyone else just looks ridiculous on me so I'm hoping more of a strappy kind of shape is going to be a bit more flattering on me so we will try that on I have high hopes for this and I love love this sage green colour they actually had some gorgeous gorgeous silky sage green pyjamas and I'm so gutted because I really wanted to look at them but there was a lady looking and I thought oh I'll come back have a little look and then I completely forgot um, so I might go back and have a look for those but this how cute is it really really sweet and that was just £13 I cannot believe that was £13 so lovely and then I got some black tights, these are actually for Effie for school, so three pairs for four fifty. very just plain. And then I got this little cardigan because I thought this was cute too, and again I massively sized up in this because I wanted it to be kind of loose and oversized. I got a size large which is supposed to be 14 to 16, but I want it really big, I might just tuck it into something, I just thought the little... The colour on it's really nice. I don't know whether you can pick it up on the camera. It's kind of like a really pale lilac-y blue colour. And I just thought it was really cute. It's really sweet. Just a little v-neck. The quality felt nice on it. Cute little sleeves. And it was just £10. Which is a bargain. So I'm just going to wear this with some like mum jeans. Some little flats. Maybe it's just over some little shorts or something while the weather's still warm. But yeah, really, really lovely and an absolute bargain. And I think they had these in quite a few colours. And they also had like a jumper, like a round neck jumper version as well. Um, so yeah, have a little look out for those. That was really nice. And then the last few things, I picked this up. I've never seen nail varnishes this small. Um, it was just 60p and I thought the, the colour was so cute. It's like a little sage green colour and I picked it up for Effie because I thought this would be a really cute colour to do her nails and her toes. I keep promising to do them for her and I thought it's a really nice one actually because I don't very often wear nail varnishes. I usually get my nails done or I've been using gels. Um, so I thought most nail varnishes don't actually get used so I thought these were really cute little minis and they had loads of pastel colours they had a really nice lemon yellow colour a lilac colour I just thought 60p is such a good little price isn't it for these because you never use a whole bottle of nail varnish so yeah got that for F and the very last thing in this bag is this you all know I love a headband and I loved this little pearl thick like 
headband. It's like an ivory colour and it's going to look so cute. I think with my hair being quite dark and then the white pearl, it's just going to stand out, look really cute and preppy, very like Gossip Girl vibes. Um, but I just can't walk past a really pretty headband at the moment. I absolutely love them. So yeah, that was £5, uh, which is good actually, because I think most headbands are like £10 and like nice ones like this are at least £10, places like Topshop and stuff. So yeah, I thought that was sweet. So yeah, that's the last thing I got. So yeah, that is the end of my very first Primark haul. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have enjoyed it and you want me to do another one or do regular Primark hauls, then do let me know in the comments below. And also let me know if you pick any of them up in Primark. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure you check out all my other fashion hauls on my, on my fashion playlist. If you're not subscribed, then go and hit that subscribe button right now because I would absolutely love to have you back here for my next video. I have got vlogs and more hauls coming for you in the next week and lots of cosy autumn content coming for you in the next few weeks. So as always, I love you all. I will see you in my next video. Bye.